I just got off the phone, Kenneth, and this has been three days, every day, two hours a day, talking to people about what happens if you over torque your attachment screws, your threaded inserts into your air conditioner. Here's the culprit right here, Kenneth. Kenneth, get it in there. Okay. This is the problem. This little guy is what holds the mounting bolt to the air conditioner. You by hand thread it, thread it, thread it, thread it, thread it, it stops. But then what happens is you start tightening the nut and it starts going like this, like this, like this, and then it pops out. Don't worry, there's a solution. Let's have Bruce, my buddy, my engineer from another mother, Two master's degrees from the School of Mines, who's way overqualified to be working over here at Nomadic Cooling. Brucey, uh, show them how to fix this problem. So your first step is to identify the parts that are needed to do this threaded insert couple light nylock nuts, all thread, there's four of them, a 7 16 inch drill bit. You will need some type of drill driver, one of several different wrenches. You can use this wrench. I prefer the half inch open end box. You could also use an adjustable wrench, some tape to identify drill depth. To begin, we're attempting to put these threaded inserts in the nomadic cooling unit. They will go in the innermost open available holes for the unit. This is your gasket that comes with it. This is your hot and cold. This is your, your feed in and your cold out. This gasket plus this plate are both used for the installation. Once you have that centered on these openings, you want to identify the innermost open holes. You can see here I've already installed two of these threaded units in these two inner holes, and you're going to do, we're going to show you how to do the others. So, your first step is to set with your 7 16 drill bit the depth in which you're going to drill. So, we take our 17 16 inch drill bit and we take our insert and we simply measure, doesn't have to be super exact, but we measure with this the depth. That's as deep as we want to go. This is because we're going to install that insert complete. So I'm just marking it with my thumb and I'm going to put a piece of tape around right here so I know how deep to, to drill my plastic. No deeper. From there, I use my thumb and I take my tape and I put a guide depth on my drill bit. I'm going to drill down to this depth in the plastic and no more. We take our drill driver and we tighten our drill bit into the drill driver. I use setting one because I don't want it to grab and get too deep. And that is a potential for this. So now I'm going to drill this hole to the proper depth for the insert. Here we start. Once it's at the right, correct depth, I'm going to hold the drill with pressure up to pull it out so it doesn't go in anymore. That has removed cleanly all of the material that needs to come out. We went right to the tape which gives us the perfect depth to not go through to any components on the other side of the air conditioning unit. I'm going to remove the drill bit and now there is a, an expensive tool that sets this but we're going to use one of the all threaded pieces and I'm just installing this in the drill. We take our all thread and we take one of our nylock nuts and we're going to use two of these, but these are going to hold the insert so it doesn't back screw into this as we screw the insert using this, this all thread into the unit. 
This is where you need your half inch open end box. So I'm using the drill to screw this on. And I've gone about three quarters of an inch. I take a second nut, and this is just to create extra resistance. And I drill that on, and I've left enough thread of the all thread to install your threaded insert. The threaded insert has groove in the top of it. There is not one in the bottom. So be sure that the groove faces up so the groove in the, in the all thread threads first onto this setup. Now we're going to install the all thread, or excuse me, the threaded insert. We're going to install the threaded insert into the nomadic cooling unit. We have our 7 16 hole. We set, we apply a decent amount of pressure, and we slowly thread, and I slipped, but we slowly thread the all thread unit right to the depth of the nut. Now it's in there, and I simply reverse the drill, and we have perfectly flush, beautifully installed threaded insert. This is done for all four of these inner mounting holes for the nomadic unit.